Hey y'all, I'm back with probably the last clay mask I'll do on my channel. I know y'all thinking like if she say clay mask one more time, but hear me out. This is Green Beauty's recipe on the best clay mask you could possibly do because it involves all three, bentonite, rizal, and kaolin clay all in one. So you'll get the benefits from all three using this mask. Also, both of her videos for these clay masks would be in the description box. Please check those out to understand all of the benefits of all three of these clays and to know why I'm even doing this in the first place. If you watched her video, you would know that my measurements are her measurements strategically cut in half. This is to keep the chemistry and pH balance of the clays without disturbing any of the benefits. At this point, you can add the oil of your choice and be done because that's the end of her recipe, but I did go the extra mile and added two more ingredients that I believe wouldn't destroy the pH balance of the mask. So after you mix everything together until it's smooth, you're just going to apply it to your hair. The only difference between me applying it this time and in my last video is I drenched my hair in water beforehand so I wouldn't have to do the extra step in spraying each section before I applied the mixture. So after you let the clay sit on your hair for about 15 minutes, you're just going to rinse it out as usual. So there aren't any physical differences of the benefits of me using this clay mask versus a regular bentonite clay mask in short term uses. But I'm sure over the long term there will be differences that I can show you guys later on. As you all should know, I never miss a deep conditioning session, so that's what I'm doing now. The link to this deep conditioning treatment will be in the description box below. As always, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys all in another one. Bye!